Hey Aquarius, this is meant to be your August 11th to the 12th messages. So when I was shuffling before I turned on the camera, they were calling me Leo. So I do feel like there could be a Leo in your life, coming into your life, or Leo season is just very significant for you when it comes to relationships. So, universe, what are the messages for the sign of Aquarius? Sun, moon, rising, Venus, sun. Okay, so we guys can be done with the Taurus or a Sagittarius. I don't know why Spirit just told me Taurus, but we do have the Temperance card here. So I really like this. I do feel like, for one, I feel like a lot of you guys could be seeing the number 444. Um, I do feel like you are very protected right now by your angels, and I do feel like you are being spiritually guided to uh, meet new people, start new things, um, things like that. We do have the Ace of Wands, so this definitely could be something new that you're starting or pursuing. It could be a job, school, project, business, or even a relationship. Okay, yeah, definitely could be a business. We have the Empress card here. Some of you guys could be finding out you're pregnant or there could be somebody close to you um, that is pregnant. But I do feel for a lot of you paired with the Ace of Wands or the Empress, this is a new business or this is a new idea that you want to act on. Okay, yeah, we have the Queen of Swords, so I see you very, being very much so in your energy. I do feel like you are a little guarded, maybe a little bit, I also want to say hesitant to start something new. Like, I don't feel like you're worried about it, but I feel like you're a little bit hesitant. We have the Justice card here as well, so I do feel like, right now, I feel like you're being shown your path, if that makes sense. So I do feel like there's going to be something coming into your life, an opportunity coming into your life very soon that you are meant to pursue yeah we have the world card here so the you guys are definitely stepping into some sort of new cycle whether this is a cycle with somebody else um, a cycle with business and finances just a whole new phase of your life we do have the star card at the bottom of the deck so i do feel like life is good right now i do feel that things are working in your favor even if maybe they don't seem like it at this time things are definitely working in your favor and i do feel like you're being rewarded and i say that because we have the empress and justice at the same um, spread. I feel like you're being rewarded. And I do feel like this is going to be in the form of a new person coming into your life or even a business idea that will just blossom. Clarifying temperance, we have the Queen of Cups and the Devil. Some of you guys could be dealing with a water sign, Cats, Pisces, Scorpio, or a Capricorn. But the fact that this is um, uh, clarifying temperance, I do feel like there's somebody um, in your life that it's like a soulmate type of energy. Um, if this is love being offered to you with the Queen of Cups, I do feel like whoever this is in your life is supposed to be in your life. Um, and I do feel like this is supposed to lead to something more, something serious. Hmm. Clarify the Ace of Wands. I do feel like those are for you that are in a new connection. Clarifying the Ace of Wands, we have the Queen of Wands. I do feel like this is your energy. I do feel like some of you guys are acting on something or the advice is to act on an idea that you have. So if you like want to start a YouTube channel or you want to start a business, um, you want to apply for school, whatever it is, now is the time to do that. Clarify the Empress. Yeah, whatever this is, it's going to provide you long-term stability. I do feel like this could be for um, relationship or work. I say relationship because we do have the Ace of Cups, the bottom of the deck right after that. So somebody's here to be in your life long-term. So it could be this Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but this person is in your life um, to be long-term. Or this is their intentions with you are for things to be long-term. Clarify the Queen of Swords. Okay. So four of wands, yeah. This is stable relationship. Um, this is also just stability in general. So I do feel like a lot of you guys are very stable, focused on stability, mental stability, um, and financial as well. I do see you guys being very stable in the month of um, August. Why is the justice card here for Aquarius? I do feel a lot of you guys could be saving money as well, or be being very focused on saving money. Clarify justice, okay. Ace of Swords. Really, I feel like you guys, justice is karma. The getting something that you deserve. I feel like a lot of you guys deserve this success. So I feel like like whatever you're acting on, you deserve the success that is coming to you. So whatever you're doing is going to be successful. This relationship that you're pursuing is going to be successful. This um, business, whatever it is, or both. Okay, yeah. Clarifying the world, we have the star. So I really feel like a lot of you guys are stepping into your power 
um, right now or the universe is giving you the opportunity to step into your power acting on your ideas um, this relationship coming in is very reliable the knight of pentacles is extremely reliable the queen of cups this person really does have strong feelings for you whoever this is doesn't have to be a new connection it just feels like a new connection because we do have the ace of wands ace of cups so this could be someone coming into your life or someone that has recently come into your life and rest, what is the advice for aquarius what is the advice okay so we have the two of cups wow two of cups and the king of cups so I do feel, I almost want to say, because the Queen of Swords, I don't know why she's just staring at me, but give this relationship a chance. I definitely feel putting your guard down because this Queen looks very guarded. She's got guard dogs, a sword, all that. So I feel like advice here with the King of Cups and the Two of Cups is put your guard down with this relationship a little bit because they are a very reliable person in your life and you definitely don't want to uh, push them out. We do have the Eight of Fire. So as advice, this is saying take action on whatever you're doing or whatever your ideas are. Now is the time to take action on them. So Aquarius, I hope this was a good reading for you. If you'd like to see me do other things besides tarot, my vlog channel is linked down below. And yeah, have a good day.